Hi, welcome to today's video where we will have a look at what the research says about stem cell supplements. In this video we are going to have a look at what benefits taking stem cell supplements can have and what research has shown to be true. What I'm going to tell you doesn't apply to all stem cell supplements and will depend on what ingredients your particular supplement contain. So, what I'm actually looking at is certain ingredients that you can often find in stem cell supplements and how they may be beneficial to you. It is up to you to check if that particular ingredient is included in your supplement. Here is one well-made study which has shown that consuming an extract of AFA quickly within an hour of consumption activates certain types of immune cells involved in protecting the body from external pathogens such as viruses and immune cells involved in long-term immunity. The same research team has also documented a rise in the amount of adult stem cells circulating in the blood after AFA consumption and an associated increased cognitive alertness and brain function. For coiden, which is a sulfur-rich polysaccharide from a brown algae has also been studied for its many benefits in several disease processes. The, the research strongly suggests that consuming phacoidin is associated with an increased rate of tissue repair as a result of an increased number of stem cells that are efficiently being directed to the place of injury. Phacoidin seems to be of greatest interest in research involving cardiovascular health where there has been damage to the heart muscle or the blood vessel. And then we have mesenchyme, which is a microalgae-based micro extract from spirulina. It has been shown to increase the blood levels of a growth factor called GCSF. One of the most important roles of GCSF is to increase the release of stem cells from the bone marrow and therefore increasing the rate at which you can heal. GCSF has been thoroughly researched and is commonly used before a stem cell transplant to encourage stem cells to be released from the bone marrow to then be collected for use in the transplant. And the good thing with mesenchyme is that it seems to be self-regulating so it's perfectly safe to use whereas you can overdose on injected GCSF. So these are some of the ingredients that research has shown that stem cell supplements can do for you. Not all stem cell supplements have all of these ingredients and if you missed my previous video where I talked about the most important ingredient to look for, you may want to go back and watch that one. So thank you so much for watching. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel and hit the bell icon so that you will be notified whenever I publish a new video. And in tomorrow's video, I will talk about stem cell supplement benefits and what happens when you have an injury. See you tomorrow.